Hi, my name is Juan Hernandez, and today I will be looking into why food trucks have become a more lucrative restaurant option in this past year by looking into a local food truck named Burrito Tex-Mex and how they have succeeded over regular restaurant businesses throughout the pandemic this year. Hi, I'm Valentina Vergara. I'm the co-owner of Burrito Tex-Mex and I'm here to talk about our local food truck. So like in 2010, uh, the main owner, the head owner, he started a restaurant, it's called Tostón, it was in 40th Street, but obviously when the pandemic hit and then people had to like, you couldn't dine inside, then we were losing a lot of money. So he, he thought like instead of keeping the restaurant, because we were gonna lose it either way, he just thought like selling it would be better. And then with that money, he began the food truck, because it was easier. You just dine outside it's, and it's faster. We opened the food truck on the late June of this year. So I would say the pandemic kind of was the reason we opened the food truck in the first place because with the other restaurants, uh, the dining inside was not working at all. So we were losing a lot of money daily. Uh, it was getting to the point where we were just, we didn't know what we were gonna live off of. So usually when people ask me for recommendations when they're new to the truck, I usually list three things. First, if you're looking for something light, uh, but still really good, the tacos are the way to go. They're easy to eat, you know, little, uh, simple meal. You could pick between one to three, like you can make the play however you want. The tacos come with guac, which is not very usual for Mexican trucks. Usually they don't provide guac and they're just, you know, Right, but we give it guac, uh, onions, and cilantro. My second plate that I always recommend, because it's one of my favorites, is the burrito. Um, the burrito has rice, beans, guac, pico, sour cream, and cheese. It's one of the, my favorite plates. It honestly, it's been very successful. Every time I recommend it, people really like it. And then the third plate, I would say enchiladas, which is, you use the same uh, tortillas, the tacos, and they're similar to tacos. You put like whatever protein people want inside, but instead of, you know, packing it with onions and whatever, we just like put a sauce over it. It's not really spicy. Um, it does have a little spice to it. It's called the green sauce. We put the, the sauce on the enchiladas and then we put guac, pico, cheese on top, sour cream. And then on the side, we give people the option to get rice, beans, stuff like that. Okay, so if you guys want to try out our food, uh, Burrito Tex-Mex, we're located in 88th Street with 137 Avenue, uh, right in front of the Chase Bank, uh, and we'll love to have you guys. I think you will really like our food.